Go. Okay, well, we are coming to the end of our journey on the habitat house here. We've had a really couple hot days. Um, we have basically put this together in two days with, I would guess, four to five people. Um, you know, three people really, really working. A couple guys on the ground getting stuff ready, but we're to the end. And here, what we're going to do is we are going to inject the ridge full of foam. And we just wanted to prepare a few things for you to show you what we're doing. Um, we're going to use, it's a maximum expansion foam, and it's a two-part uh, mixing component. And we have, sh we have already shaken the containers for about a minute, minute and a half a piece. Got them good and mixed up. And uh, we're going to have a tip here that goes on to the end of the gun, just like this. This goes in here. That snaps on like that, so that's the end of it. And we are actually going to uh, test it to make sure everything is working. Now how we're going to do that, we are going to open up both tanks. We're going to make sure that we open these both up exact, both up 100%. These two components have to mix together or you're not going to have a good product. So we want to test it in a box and make sure it's all working right. You know that it's going to look good. It's going to look like that. If it was not working, it would look like snot. It would look almost like it's just dripping. But you can tell it's giving us a good even mixture. And we're going to go up onto the roof now and put this stuff on. We're going to do it in a hurry. Okay, so we're up on top of the roof and we are simply going to seal the bottom. We're going to put that down in about as far as I can go and I'm just going to shoot it. And it's fanning out so I want to get it down as far as I can. And we're going to come back again. So I'm just going to keep foaming as I go. I've got a nice bead halfway down the whole entire thing. And now you can see some areas are already coming up. And I think we're just going to layer it with a nice another bead. I can tell one area I need to put a little more in here. Other than that, we may not even have to run another bead. The nice thing about this stuff is you know right away if it's working. And it is working. I don't know that we even have to run another bead through. We'll put it where we need to. But we don't want to have this stuff four feet high either. It's doing a really nice job of filling in that whole ridge. And I can tell when I when I ran the fan parallel to the ridge, it liked it better. And there we go. Now, we're basically done. I think what we're going to do here is step off, step off onto our platform. And we'll show you another little trick here. Flight Tony to Marshall North Ambulance. Ambulance is needed at 900 Cheryl. Ambulance is needed at 900 Cheryl. We are going to take this end off. I'll put this the in the box. Is telling me she is awake, but she can't seem to And we are going to take in the little packet. There's a petroleum jelly packet. And we're simply going to take it and lube up this whole end so the rest of it can be used on something else. That'll keep everything fresh. 
and ready for the next user just like that and here we're coming to an end on the habitat house this was the last step and uh, we're told that they're going to put the synthetic underlayment on in the next day or so and they'll have it shingled by the weekend so we're sitting good this has been a fun little project and hope you enjoy the videos we've taken the extreme sales team we've done a lot to put this stuff all together for you and we hope it, it helps you out in the field thanks